Hi friends, now we are going to discuss about what are the Fiori app alternative that you have for reports for related with purchase acquisition. So here I am searching with ME5 and this is the this is the uh, transaction code that you can use. This is the Fiori app you should be using. Monitor purchase acquisition item. So if I do ME5 star and do a search, does it show everything? Yes, see here you can see monitor purchase requisition is there. So you, you can find a lot of stuff here. So it's very useful. So if you see where is the monitor here, item but purchase requisition items. So this is one which 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 should take care of lots of things. So let's go and check how this app works. So I'm in the monitor purchase requisition and it's displaying. Okay. Um, so it's showing up. Let's see. It will, it will show up after some time. And in the meantime, I can show you some of the app that some of the app, the other stuff, how you can find the Fury app for particular stuff in in SAP. Okay, so if I go here, this is the table. I give T, T code ME5 star probably. If I do an F8, I'll get all these things. So here, if you can see their stuff, so you can see ME51N. So here you can see ME5J, ME5A. So let's do one thing. Uh, so you can see ME5K, ME5A. This is display by accounting, display list. Then you have ME5J, display by project. And you have display by source. Of supply so in the meantime this shows up finally okay and here do I have a mandatory feed I don't think so probably let's see so here you can see you can find all the stuff so you can see by account assignment category by material my plant you can find all these things so if you want to change if you want to add more valve fields so you can see created by if I want created by I can get the desired filter I have desired vendor here and suppose I have other thing I can go for purchasing group and and that's it I'll click OK and I'll get all the information so if you see if I scroll to the so you can see purchasing group desired. the good thing is it adjusts did you notice it adjusts itself so that's lovely so if I click on this I'll get the information I don't know it takes me to ME53N or something uh, but you know it doesn't it has some problems here in this system but you know uh, in a full-grown system you'll get all the information so let me go back and again uh, here if I click on the material this will say you can go to this material and see whether it shows the product so this also is showing this because those probably those those apps are not activated but for this, you can get information from here. You can call other apps. So if I click on manage supply line items, this will call the Fiori app manage supplier items. And from here, you will get all the information you think of. Okay. So here you can see manage supplier items. It has this value populated. And if you want to see, uh, you can get. But there's nothing information here. So that's why you're not getting. Okay, so if I go back, I hit the back button, pretty easy, pretty slick. And now here you can see, you can see the different dollar amounts and all those things. Now if you download, you can download to a spreadsheet, you can always share it. If you click on share, you can share it in an email or save it as a tile. This is very, very useful and you can put lots filter if you want. Okay, so here you can see you can put filter and you can... Uh, what is this you can press spin header on press or something so these are different filters that you can hide put and this is really helpful so that's it stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and if you like it share it and subscribe to it because every day there is a new video coming thank you and have a great day